everyone, and welcome back to Fragment's Note. Last time, we got rejected. And then we met up with our daughter from the future. And then our Russian childhood friend came into who transferred into our class. And apparently Yuki had, Yuki had made a promise that she would be his girlfriend the next time they met. So there's that. Well anyway, what's gonna happen now? Oh, I'm beat. Well, I don't blame you. After class, the teacher called me into his office and stormed me with lectures. And when I got back to class back to the classroom, my classmates showered me with questions. I guess I brought this on myself. Ugh, I'm so tired. Good thing today's Saturday, huh? Tell me about it. What did you expect? Doing something like that in front of the entire class? Well, that thing, huh? Like, kissing her? I know, I know. Hey, Yukiha. Yeah? That wasn't your first time, was it? Well, I have been kissing my sister quite a bit, so... <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and not comment on that. That's fine. I won't ask any further. Phew. I'd rather die than tell him I kiss my sister every morning. Especially because I've heard Mikia holds Haya in high regard. Or... He holds her in... Hiya, regard! Oh my god! How do you know her anyway? You guys seem a little too intimate to be just friends. I guess childhood friend would be the most accurate description. Childhood friend? Yeah, our family was in Russia for a couple of years when I was younger. Ah, oh, that explains it! Oh, I see. I see a void in Kazuhide's eyes where life used to be. Where did life go? Hmm. Poor Kazuhide. After I told him about my relationship with Misha, he's been ranting about how, about how he's lost all hope in life. He had his mutual fit? Yep. Kazuhide has a bad habit of falling for girls at first sight. Every time he asks them out and gets turned down. So, where to? Hmm? We're hanging out somewhere, right? Uh, unless you guys are tired, we can take a, a rain check. Right, uh... Hi, Yukiha! Is this, is this a good time? Hmm. Hey, Misha! Oh, hey, Misha. What's up? If you're not too busy, I was wondering if you... I was wondering if you, if you can give me a short tour of the campus. Right, uh... Give her the tour, man. You can hang out any time. If you guys are cool with it. Um... I'm Mikia... Uh, I'm Asaka. Yuki has friend. Nice to meet you! It's nice to meet you, Mikiha! Nice to meet you, Mikiha! I'm Misha! Misha takes Mikiha's hand and breathes. The, the pleasure's all mine. Ah, oh, great! He's in love with her, too. Your face is so red right now. I mean, his glasses are... Shut up! Go show her around campus already. I'll see you later. Ha <laughs> Later! Was Mikia alright? He's fine. There aren't that many people in this world who can keep a straight face placed in that situation. You're a moral human being after all! Shut up already! Ow! Ouch! Oh wait! Don't wait! I'm shutting up! Stop! Should we stop them? Nah, they're just messing around. <laughs> oh 
Okay, they seem like fun people. They are. Alright then, shall we? We shall! Yukitsuki? Yuki, are you okay? Are you jealous, Yuki? Are you jealous, Yuki Tsuki? You better not be jealous. I mean, you had your chance to go out with him, but wait a second. Doesn't you already have? Doesn't she already have a boyfriend? So how could she be jealous? Oh my! Oh my goodness! This is so confusing. I think that's the gist of the campus. Any questions? No, I think I got it. Hey, you can help? Yeah. Gotcha! Gotcha! Misha jumps up and hugs my arm. <laughs> Misha has always been on the physically in intimate side. Hey, Misha, this is a little embarrassing. Aw, oh, come on, dude! Unfair when someone is accused, Misha pleads. I can't say no to that. Alright. Just for today, though, okay? Yay! You're just as nice as I remember. I've always liked that about you. Thanks. Are you blushing? Oh. This is a, this is an announcement for Misha Eisenstein. Misha Eisenstein, please report to the nurse's office. Again, this announcement is for Misha Eisenstein. Misha Eisenstein, please report to the nurse's office. I wonder what's going on. Was that Haya on the loudspeaker just now? She might have mentioned she was coming by school today. Nurse's office? Do you remember where that was? Yep, it's all up here. In my brain. I'm going to the nurse's office then. Oh, she's with me. Misha lightly touched my cheek. I'll see you later, Yukiha! And off she goes. Hmm, I don't recall her being this intimate. Cultural differences, I suppose. Or maybe she just likes you. This announcement is for Yukiha Tenjo. Yukiha Tenjo, please report to the principal's office immediately. Ah, oh, great, first her, now, no me. Again, Yukiha Tenjo. Please report to the principal's office immediately. Now there's something me. It's probably about that thing with Misha. But why the principal's office? I don't have a good feeling about this. <sighs> Thank you very much. Phew. I forgot that Misha came from an acclaimed house in Russia. Still, I wasn't expecting the principal to personally ask me to look after her. Just how powerful is Misha's family exactly? In any case, I should probably go and check up on her. She's probably hanging around with Haya. Now that I think about it, Haya must have heard about the kiss with Misha too. Part-time nursing te teacher as she may be, she's still faculty. Shoot, how should I explain it to her? Haya can get pretty jealous about these things. She's probably gonna, go, gonna bombard me with questions. I am not looking forward to that. I feel like I you haven't had a moment's peace since yesterday. The rejection from Yuki, the son's pure parents of my, my daughter Miu from the future, the reunion with Misha, one thing after another. Hmm, I feel like I'm forgetting something. What was it? There was one more thing. No bells are ringing. Whatever, nature will take its course. Hiya, I'm coming in. Yuki, huh? Wait, don't look at the door! Oh! Oh dear! It's. Did we just walk in on Misha? Why is she changing her clothes exactly? Huh? 
I opened the door to, to find Misha standing there with nothing but a dress shirt on. Isn't she, isn't she wearing a skirt, though? Awkward! Yukiha! So sorry, I thought Misha was, might still be around. Well, she's right there. You came to pick me up! Misha hugs me. Misha? Her embrace is even softer and warmer than the last one. Hey, Misha? Yes? You should wear some clothes. Her feminine parts are starting to peak. Hmm? I don't mind you seeing. That's kind of you to say, but... Ah! What did I do? Hey, don't move around so much, Yukiha. The sensation against my chest feels slightly different from before. Wait a minute, is this... M Misha, how are you wearing this? Put some clothes on! Don't just stand there, Yukiha! Get out already! Oh, okay, getting out, getting out, I got it. And don't look back! Am I making myself clear? Well, loud and clear! Yes, yes ma'am! I don't mind at all! Well, some people do! Hey, Yukiha! You wanna touch? Um. Misha! Enough already! Okay, okay... Phew! I rest my back against the wall and slide to the floor. Misha is... So pretty... I can't get the image of the. I can't get the image of the barely dressed Misha dressing out of my mind. Why did I say barely dressed? Ugh, never. No, forget it. Stop thinking about it already. So that was what I was forgetting. The happy incident Miu predicted earlier. So much happened this morning that I completely forgot about that. <sighs> Everything went exactly as she predicted. Which means she really does know what the future holds. Which means I don't really have a choice but to believe her. My future daughter. Yuki ha, can you you can come in now? Ah, okay. Sorry, Yuki ha. You were taking Misha's physical. No, I'm sorry I didn't wait for an answer when I knocked. I'm so out of it today. Well, a lot has happened, so... You too, Misha! You can't say things like that to boys in these situations. But I don't really mind if it's Yukiha! Misha! You're no fun, Haya. Oh, really, you haven't changed one bit, Misha. <laughs> What's that supposed to mean? Oh, I accidentally. Why are you laughing about Yukiha? You have to watch out for her too, you know. Stop nagging, Haya. We're finally reunited. We're celebrating. I'm a teacher at the school. I nag because I have to. At school, we have to follow the school's rules. Is that clear? Oh. Alright, alright. You too, Yukiha! You need to call me Miss Tenjo at school! Sorry, duly noted, Miss Tenjo. Me too. <laughs> Misha and Auntie Haya haven't changed at all. Um, is that me? Who said that? There are only three people in this room! Misha and Haya turn pale. I'd be scared if this is this were my first time too. Misha and Haya are like this in the future. Yep, they were always arguing about how to raise me and what I should call them and stuff. That's surprisingly easy to imagine. Yukiha, Yukiha, what's going on? So what you say, Daddy? Believe me now. I believe you now. Yippee! And here comes 
meet you. There's a sudden distortion in the space before us, and out of the distortion, Miu jumps out and hugs me. Well, this is gonna be awkward. A, a girl? She just peered down nowhere. Nice to meet you both. My name is Miu Tenjo. I'm Yuki Hutt's. I'm Yuki Hutt Tenjo's daughter from the future. Seems like I won't be getting at that moment's peace for a while. You don't say. Let me get this straight. So, you're telling me you're Yukiha's daughter? Yep! I'm sorry, I just can't believe it. I think that's the normal response, Haya. Well. You can't really blame me. And you can You believe all this? I do. Well, I don't really have a choice to at this point. She's demonstrated enough to convince me she's telling the truth. Demonstrated? Yeah. Hmm. I believe what this girl's saying. What? Misha! She seems so sweet. Just look at her. She wouldn't go around telling lies. Yeah, she seems sweet, but... Besides, Yukiha believes her. I don't need any further reason to do the same. You're right. If Yukiha trusts her, then I need to trust her too. Thanks, Misha! Thanks, Antihaya! So, what's up, Miu? You need me for, for something? Actually, I need Talk with Misha and Auntie Haya. With Misha and Haya? Yep. Oh yeah, she was saying Misha was the key to changing my future. Daddy, do you remember what I said about Misha this morning? Yeah. Well, Auntie Haya is also a key. Haya too? Wait, what does she mean by key? Well, both of them have frowns. Well, she's not so much key as she is someone who might be a key to unlocking other futures. There are also several other people who can, who can be the key, but right now, Misha and Auntie Haya are the most likely. I'm not following any of this. Me neither. I'm here to explain all this to you two. You can start a different future. Mew? Mew? But before that... Miu takes my arm, pulls out a syringe, and injects, injects me. Oh crap. What? I'm sorry, Daddy. Miu. Oh! What's happening? My body feels... weak. Did you... drug me? I can't believe it, I've been drugged by my, by my own daughter. I can't stay focused. Yukiha? Yukiha! Don't worry, there's no harm done to his body. Why did you I want to keep I want to keep uncertainties at a minimum minimum. What are you saying? Daddy, I'll do anything to change your future. I'll do anything to make you happy. Even if that means you hating me. I'll see you again tomorrow. Mew. Good night, Daddy. Everything's fading. And I've collapsed. Okay, are you two ready? I'm going to tell you about the future. Daddy's future. And Daddy's incident. This is the future that I came from. <gasps> I came back in time to prevent this from happening. What the heck happened? And I'm prepared to do anything for it. Even if that means daddy hating me. Even if that means everybody hating me. I'm prepared to do anything. Okay, seriously, what the heck happened? 
Ugh, is it time to get up? My body feels so heavy. What happened yesterday? Don't worry, there's no harm done to his body. Daddy, I'll do anything to change your future. I'll do anything to make you happy. Even if that means you hating me. I'll see you again tomorrow. Oh yeah, I was drunk by my own daughter. That's right, Mew drunk me yesterday. Ow! Ugh, that hurts. I thought she said there was no harm done to my body. My body's so sore. Ugh. I'm sorry, Daddy. Mew? What did she inject me with? Yukiha? I heard a really loud sound. Is everything alright? I... yeah. It's no use. I can't talk! Ah! A sharp pain shoots in my body every time I try, try to talk. What's going on? Yukiha? Is everything alright? I'm coming in! What's wrong, Yukiha? I, uh... Yukiha! Haya hurriedly makes her way towards me. Are you alright? Sorry, Haya. You think you can lower your voice? It's giving me a headache. I'm gonna call in the ambulance! There's no there's no need for that, Auntie Haya. Mew? What's she doing here? But Calm down! Don't call an ambulance! It's okay. Everything's gonna be fine. I'm going to fix him up. Really? Really. Me. You don't need to talk, Daddy. I know what. I know it makes your head hurt. Just relax, and I'll make it all go away. Mew takes my hand and injects me with her syringe gun. The fluid she used is of a different color from yesterday. Contrary to my clouding consciousness, the pain sheets clear through my body. God, it hurts so bad. Flashing colors! Huh? My body doesn't hurt! Yukiha? Are you alright? Yeah, it's so weird. All the pain's gone. What's going on? So quick. You're just as amazing as I expected! What? Remember how I injected you yesterday? She points at her syringe. I do. Yesterday, I injected you with a medicine from the future. A medicine from the future? Mm-hmm. Now you can use tools from the future just like me. Does it have any si Does it have any side effects? None! They refine stem cells, so they'll actually make him better. How can you think I'd ever do anything to hurt him? That's true. The two of them are acting drastically different from yesterday. What happened after I lost co consciousness? I'm sorry. I'm sorry for doubting you. Wait a minute. Weren't stem cells still experimental? They were saying on TV it'd be a good while before it's ready for commercial use. Well, she is from the future. Hey, Mew, weren't stem cells those cells that can morph into any other cell in your body? Any other cell in your body? That's the one! If I remember correctly, weren't they still experimental? They're used commercially in the future! Right, forgot about that. So, all that pain I was in just now. I think what you felt were the stem cells hard at work. Ordinarily, you get those shots when you're born, and gradually up your dose as you grow older. Does that mean there were a lot of things wrong with my body? I guess so. I'm sorry, Daddy. I didn't think that was going to happen. I injected you with painkillers just now, so you shouldn't be hurting anymore. Yeah, I'm fine now. Good, I'm relieved. Jeez, you really had me worried. Miu, you had to tell us these things ahead of time. I'm sorry. Why is Miu here anyway? 
She told me she didn't have a place to stay, so I brought her back to our house. Huh? Where did she stay before? She's just been homeless. And so I was thinking of having her live here with us. What do you say? What did Mom and Dad say? They were both ecstatic. <laughs> I guess they were always saying they wanted a third child. Except that this is their grandchild, so... In that case, I'm all for it. She's my daughter, after all. Yeah. Thanks, Daddy! So, what were you guys talking about while I was knocked out yesterday? Uh, I'm gonna go set up breakfast. I'll help! Great, let's go! Avoiding the question, are we? Wow. I guess they're not gonna tell me anything about yesterday. Hi and Mew are both pretty stubborn. Mew. Daddy, I'll do anything to change your future. I'll do anything to make you happy. Even if that means you hating me. What could drive such a young child with such determination? And that grim face she slips now and then. I wonder if there's anything I can do to help her. I'm starting to get worried about what the future held for me. Whatever it was, it must have been really awful. Burdening my own child like this. Daddy, breakfast is ready! I'm coming! Well, I guess... Maybe we can save this for next time. So! Hopefully soon, we can find out exactly what happened in the future to Yukiha. So, thank you all for watching. Be sure to leave a like. And see ya in the next one. Yep, see ya.